Former President Barack Obama wrapped up a rally earlier tonight in North Las Vegas to help Vice President Kamala Harris in her race against Donald Trump. News 3's Andrew Namura was there. The line outside of Cheyenne High School in North Las Vegas stretched as far as the eye could see, with people waiting to hear from former President Barack Obama. I think that um, he will deliver the message that we need to hear. A defining message is key in a battleground state where polls show it's a toss-up between Harris Walls and a Trump Vance ticket. Several issues are top of mind, including economy, cost of prescription drugs, and social security. I mean, the gas prices, the food, um, it's very difficult for families to make it right now. She took my insulin down and I don't have to pay all that money like I was paying. And some voters just looking for a change in rhetoric. I am more concerned about integrity and honor. Mm. Um, I think we need to go back to that. Well, I'm hoping that he can clarify some things that he addressed with the black men. Obama has garnered some criticism with recent comments towards black men and their apparent lack of support for the vice president. This voter believes those comments are warranted. He wasn't talking to every black man. Mm. He was talking to those who needed to hear that. And those that are complaining about it, they needed to hear it again. Hello, Vegas! Just before 8, the former president addressed the fiery crowd. On a day where early in-person voting kicked off in the Silver State, he reminded supporters the stark contrast between Harris and former President Trump and what's at stake. We do not need to see what an older, loonier Donald Trump looks like with no guardrails. America's ready to turn the page. We're ready for a better story.